Our Great God has been one of my favorite worship songs for about the past five years. We lead worship a lot, and that's been one of the common songs that um, that we have used and that, uh, just experienced the Lord moving powerfully through um, over the last few years. And I've always known it was this amazing song, and I've been waiting for somebody to record it, um, I guess a new version of it, and for it to sweep the nation and for the church to be able to grab a hold of this song. And I waited and waited, knowing it was going to be a powerful song for the church. And, well, I finally waited long enough, and nobody ever recorded it, so I did it myself. And uh, I got my friend Rebecca St. James to join me singing this uh, wonderful song by Fernando Ortega and Mac Powell. This is Our Great God. And praise to better questions about questioning God and asking God these difficult questions, um, exploring the mystery of God, I, I knew that I wanted to get a worship song on the record that dealt with the vastness and the mystery of God, and I just couldn't think of a better song. Isaiah 55 is long and one of my favorite chapters of the Bible. And when you jump in in verse 9, it says, For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. God is telling us that, well, basically, He's bigger than we are. And that all that He is, is, is more than we can comprehend. And that He thinks not just, you know, more or better than we do, but differently. Um, we use the word holy to describe God, and when you look up the definition, it means set apart. It means other. It means different. It, it's not just a church term. It means something completely different than we are, and that's one of the reasons we worship the Lord. It's not only because of His love and His mercy and His grace, but we also worship the Lord because of who He is, and that He is other, that He is holy, that He is bigger and different than we are. We worship God because we do not understand Him. We can never comprehend God, and yet for some reason He allows us to know Him. And, and that's a powerful and special thing.